Hello and welcome to the verdict as Blues secure a big away win here at Oakwell. Two first half goals from Paul Caddis and a lovely strike from Nicola Ziggett secured the points before half time. I was joined in the commentary box this afternoon with Paul Tate and Paul, a fantastic win that was. Brilliant win. Uh, as we were saying before the game, it's imperative that we got result today. Put seven points between us now and Barnsley, going to a really busy Christmas period. But following on from the Huddersfield away game, when we were fantastic with a 3 1 win. That was brilliant there today. First half the game was won. Could have gone in five or six goals up first half. Um, first 20 minutes, second half was a bit dodgy, uh, but the game was won. Barnsley, three changes they made, but uh, they were never in it, to be truthful. It's vitally important to start quick and start positively away from home, and that's what we saw again here today, and we reap the rewards for that. Yeah, I've been saying for ages now, the quality going in, when, when Zigic is playing, the quality going into him, he's unplayable when he gets good ball and the, the ball into him today was good. It lets Lingard, Novak, players like that to get round him. And uh, that's how we create. And, you know, we created quite a lot of chances today. But overall, the performance, a brilliant away performance and fully deserved three points. And the quality of the goals, particularly the first and the third, were outstanding, really. Yeah, fantastic. I mean, Paul Caddy's picked the ball up, beat a couple of players. You know, thought, why not have a shot? Had a shot, 25 yards, Butland, no chance. And Ziggich just wanted a bit fortunate to go through, Ziggich was. I think, uh, good break. What I think it was Joe O'Brien, their player, um, put Ziggic in, unfortunately for him, but brilliant for us. And Jack Butland coming out towards him, big Ziggy, chipped the ball over him. It was a great finish and he shows his quality, what quality, you know, he's played at a very high level. And that's now seven points from the last three games. The confidence must be really high in the dressing room. Yeah, it's got to be. I mean, we're scoring goals. You know, scored six or six goals away from home now in the last two, game, two away games. Uh, going into two home games now, Doncaster and Middlesbrough. Tuesday and Saturday. So let's kick on. How far can we go up the league? You know, the players are full of confidence. They come off the pitch there, um, you know, smiling, hugging each other. But before the game, I always look at before the game, I do, are, are, they, are they trying? You know, are they up for it or not? And today, just by looking at them, they looked up for it, as they did at Huddersfield. And the camaraderie is good. They're playing for the manager. And the manager brought in a lot of players in the summer. Are we now seeing, obviously, you need to give them time to bed in. We're now seeing the best of them now. They've had time to settle in together. Possibly. They've had time to bet in. There's a lot of young players here, like even homegrown, like Callum Riley. Tom Adeyemi has obviously come on loan from Norwich. Um, we're not in a false position. At the start of the season, I, I said we'd struggle, you know, and we have struggled um, in various parts of the season. But games like that, games like Huddersfield, you know, that's where the confidence builds in our team, especially for the younger players, the old heads like Zigic and Paul Robinson, you know, to see them through. It's just, and I want to keep the, the team no, no more sendings off. You know, it's imperative that we keep everyone on, you know, on the field. Well, thanks for joining me this afternoon, no Paul. Blues now on the back of that win going to a home double header, starting with Doncaster on Tuesday night.